Hey, this is Dan Lehman from automationhelpers.com. And today we're gonna to talk about how we can set up recurring tasks inside of SmartSuite. Now I encourage you to follow along. If you haven't yet signed up for SmartSuite, we've got an affiliate link in the description below. Right now I have a solution just dedicated for meetings and I have an app for meetings as well. Now, of course, remember that we've got lots of flexibility when it comes to the naming conventions and the types of apps that we can create. So there really isn't a specific task type app. In fact, we can have meetings. We could really create anything into a task that we wanted to simply because we've got the ability to have a status and assign to field and a due date. So in this use case, I want to be able to create a weekly team meeting for my team. And we want to set that up automatically because life gets busy and I want to be able to create that record with an agenda, assign it to me and make sure that it's on my radar in my work area. In order to do this, we can set up an automation. Let me open up this automation. We've got one that we've called Create Weekly Team Meeting. And we're having this automation run on a trigger for at a scheduled time. Over on the right-hand side, we can see that we've selected the Meetings app. And we're selecting which day of the week we want it to run on. In this case, because my meeting is on a Monday, I'm having it run on a Sunday and we'll have this run continuously each week so that we can create our meeting record. Let's head to our action. And for our action, we're going to have it create a record. And again, this is going to be for that meetings app. And then we've got the ability, I called this an agenda field. By default, SmartSuite has a description field, and that field is a smart doc type. And I really like the smart doc because we've got the ability for rich text formatting, so I've used the WYSIWYG editor. I don't see all of the features here that I'd expect from the Smart Doc, but it's still really nice to be able to have that formatting. So I've got different headings that I'm utilizing. I've got links to some documents. And this is something that I would expect the agenda would change slightly week to week, but at least I have my structure around it. I can go in, make a quick edit right before the meeting. I've also assigned a type of weekly team meeting. I've assigned this to myself. And we're saying that we want the due date to be tomorrow, knowing, of course, that the operation runs on a Sunday, and so it'll be created for a Monday. So we can go ahead and save that automation. And then when that automation runs, we'll have a newly created record. In this case, I have an automatically generated title, which concatenates the type of meeting with the date. I've got it stored as backlog right now so I can change the status of it. It's assigned to me. I've got the date and then my agenda is sitting there and I can either open it up from the grid view or I can open up the record itself. And there it is with all my nice rich text format. I'd love to hear how you're planning on using recurring tasks in the comments below. And as always, if you have questions on setting up your implementation, please reach out to us over at automationhelpers.com.